Hey everybody, welcome back to Satisfactory. I made my decision, and my decision is we are going to rescue the truck now, and I'm bringing you with me because this is frightening. And I want company. <laughs> so, you're coming along for the ride. Uh, I don't know where that big spider went, which is even more frightening. But I'm sure everything will be fine. <laughs> for this truck rescue mission, we are drinking a plasma spitter, which is ironic, because there's a lot of those around. Plasma spitter is tequila, triple sec, blue curacao, melon liqueur, and some soda water. Cheers. Okay. So, this truck is missing. It's over here. I don't know how it got here. I have no idea how it got here. It was supposed to be going from here to here. But somehow... Well, I guess it goes like this. Oh, no, that's the way. Yeah, that's the way it goes. I don't know how it ended up over there, but it's out of gas, and it's over there. And this is not in the pink forest. This is under the pink forest. So, or the red forest, whatever color that forest is up there. We've been up there. It is not up there. It's down here somewhere. I'm assuming in a cave, or the cave entrance, I'm assuming, is down here somewhere. What else is down here is this guy, who I've been shooting, but keeps hiding behind this rock column. And a giant spider, and I don't know where the giant spider has gone. I think I killed that guy. But this spider is going to come out of nowhere and scare the crap out of me and probably kill me. So let's try to not let that happen. He was over here. Should I just bring another truck? Oh, that answers that question. Yoink! Ha! Ah, you can't get me now. However, I also can't move. <laughs> oh, this is awkward. God, look at this thing. Please, could you leave so I can put gas in my truck? Please? Oh my gosh. What do we do? I got the power now! <laughs> and is one of these? Nope. Okay, I'll get some more juice. Let's hold on. Yes. Yes, go. Go. Do it. Come on, Spitter. I'd way rather you win this battle. Oh, Spitter. Oh, it's dead. We did a... <laughs> okay. So we're looking for a cave somewhere in this cliff face. And I might just grab this one here. Tasty uh, purple power slug. Sweet. Yeah, this is way less frightening in a truck. Oil, I got plans for you too. Okay, I don't see any caves. Interesting. There's gas pillars all over the place, too. Oh, no. I don't know if I can build a man maneuver my way through here. No, maybe I can go this way. <gasps> I'm not fitting through here. I thought this water was shallower. It is not.
Could you not, please? You yeah, stinky bugs. Okay, you know what? I think this truck is done. I don't think we're ever finding it. Oh, I shouldn't have come in here. So, okay. I'm pretty sure this truck is gone forever. So I say, forget it. It's not worth it. Let's go to the sulfur, which is, is it right here? Sulfur node's not right here. It is right here. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, we did it, guys. <laughs> All right, sweet. Not too shabby. Yeah. Go team. Hold on, we'll just, uh... <gasps> oh, avert your eyes, doggo. This is going to be real ugly real soon. Doggo, no! Why, Doggo? Okay. There's three of these things, aren't there? Yeah, maybe there's not. Hey, uh... I got a thing. Would you like some? I don't have them in my inventory anymore. That's bad. Excuse me, doggo. Pay attention to me. Oh, I hear him. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Be besties. I shall call you Fezzik. Oh. We're going for a theme here. I think that's how you spell it. Or is it ZZ? Z? I think that's correct. Good job, Doggo. Continue being awesome. Oh, I did not want those leaves. Okay. So let's build our miner here which is not going to have any power because i didn't run power lines because i was on a, doing something different and now i'm not so everything is going swimmingly i got it, dude there's bad there's bad things here okay Really? Yeah, this is having a great time. You enjoying this? <laughs> oh, did I not build it? I think I got hogged before I had a chance to build it. You can just go away. Now, annoyingly, I think we're just going to build a biomass generator. Oh, so I probably shouldn't have thrown those stupid leaves out. Oh, I do have coal. Oh, I don't have any water. Okay, biomass it is. And we'll get a nice stack of this. And while we're waiting, we can play with the lizard doggo. You're pure, right? No, you're normal. That's disappointing. How would you feel about being slugged out? Uh, okay. 
I have biomass in my inventory, don't I? I don't. I do. Go. Okay. My crunch berries. So, while that's going, what else is here that we can get into? There's got to be a power slug here somewhere. This is too big of an area to not have a power slug. Let's see all these stink plants here. You guys got a power slug hidden down here somewhere? Uh, I'll see one. Hmm. So yeah, I'm giving up on this truck. I don't know where it is. Maybe it's something we'll find in the future. Oh, is it in the big cave that like comes down like that? Into the green fields? It can't be. Or could it be? Hmm. <laughs> so much mystery. Anyhow. I'm giving up. I'm just going to leave that stupid path there. I don't know why his... Or the truck's path stayed... Or, first off, became visible. Because I definitely had it turned off. Why it popped up all of a sudden. I don't really care about the truck or what it was carrying. I just want my path gone. Now, it does mean that we're going to need to make another truck on that route. Which is also kind of annoying. Maybe while the sulfur is doing its thing, we could do that. Should we do that? We're pretty close. We could. We could do that. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Go for a quick drive. We know this area pretty well. Whoa. So they released a uh, sat or satisfactory coffee stain released a video today explaining some of the bugs in the early access release and the way the vehicle is driving. It's not a bug, but I think they're going to tweak it a bit. And I'm hoping they get rid of the uh, some of the bounciness. Oh, this is very high up. I don't think this is the way I want to go. They get rid of some of the bounciness and the, the driftiness on the tractor. is crazy. Um, one of the other bugs they're talking about is the way things on the belts, like items on the belts look. You know how I had the like, ghosty iron ingots earlier on? That is a bug. Um, it's related to do with the new like anti-aliasing anti -aliasing things. So I tried messing around with my anti-aliasing settings. Oh, God. Come on. Is there no way around other than through the stupid... This cave that I haven't blown open yet? I need dynamite for everything, man. Ugh. Okay, we'll do that later. We're not gonna go rerun that truck. I'll do that in between episodes. I was hoping I could get down there and do it while we're waiting for this... Um... Yellow stuff, but... It's taking too long. So forget it. So yeah, I was playing with the anti-aliasing, but uh, it didn't seem to make a difference to the way it looked on the belts. And apparently it looks even worse on faster belts, so I think that's something they are going to fix. The other thing they're talking about as a bug is the... Uh, I think that should be probably plenty for the time being. Um, the... Hi, buddy. I doubt you have something for me. No. Uh, the item is being left on belts. So even though there's nothing on the belt, like you'll still see something on the belt. Like it happened to me with wood. Um, it happened to me with something else as well, where there was something on the belt, or it looked like there's something on the belt, but the belt was actually empty. That is also a bug, and apparently it's a very difficult bug to fix. Which is funny, because it seems like so insignificant, but it is not. 
So that is something that will also be fixed at some point, but probably not anytime soon. Luckily, none of it's game-breaking. I mean, so far, I feel like this, this update's been pretty sweet. Other than my truck getting randomly lost. I don't know what the deal was with that. Hopefully it doesn't happen again. I'm going to record a new path. And hopefully make it good. Don't do it. Yeah, you chose violence, not me. Yeah, everything's really good so far. I'm having a great time. It looks really nice. Just a few little graphical bugs which I can survive. Oh, and whatever happened to the truck. But I can survive that too. We'll persevere. We're go-getters, right? We can do it. Okay. Let's go back and make some explosives and start blowing stuff up. Because that is a good way to take out our anger on our truck being all messed up. Now, I'm assuming... Oh, the way, pillberries. There's a way for me to get back to this facility. Look out, Lizard Doggo! Yeah, I see my wire. Okay. Oh, um, speaking about bringing trucks and stuff over here, I do want to build, like, road kind of design things. So rather than us drive, driving on the ground here, like, with it being all rough and gross and weird, um, I think we're going to have, like, a kind of from where that bridge is down there, like a three tile wide road coming up here and around that the trucks can drive on in order to deliver things. I think that seems like a good idea. Um, okay. I am going to need the man, please. And we are going to start doing dynamitey stuff. And if I need more dynamitey stuff, I can always go back to the sulfur. It's not too far away. Oh, I did burn a lot of coal, though. Luckily, we got a fancy new coal belt, which I think I'm just going to run under the facility here. That'll be fine. Oops, that's not the right thing yet. Um, which I'm actually going to need to do. Probably right now. What am I looking for? Sulfur. Okay. What are you? I can get you too. It's real to power generation. This is going to take me to uh, turbo fuel, which I don't really care about. Yeah. Okay, whatever. Why don't we have you make us some black powder without any sulfur? How does that strike you? He's not plugged in. Is that why they're still... They're not plugged in. Interesting. Oh, uh, these aren't going to be permanent. I'm going to rejig this in a little bit. So, for now, let's just get our coal in here and be done with it. Uh, and coal, I'm just going to smack it through the floor. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> oh, I can't get to my floor anymore because I closed it off. So we will at some point have to make a little access down here. Because this will all be closed off at some point. Now, was I smart? I was smart. Good job, me. I got the wall hangers. And by wall hangers, I mean ceiling hangers.
Let's just be safe. I don't want to fall in the water. That's going to ruin my day if I do that. It's easier to delete things than swim 8,000 kilometers. Okay, those are cool. Very cool. So, we're making dynamite. Maybe while that is happening, we can start thinking about, whoops, not erasing our walls. Actually, while that's happening, we can start building out our uh, this platform where the trucks are going to be. That seems like a great idea. Uh, actually, no, it doesn't because oh, I do. I didn't think I had enough frames, but I do have frames. Sure, let's let's build this out a bit. So, this is going to go like this. Beans, you guys got to get out of here. This is getting a little ridiculous. Oh, these stupid stink plants. No. No stink plants. Oops, that was a mistake. I should not have done that. You gotta be like that. Yeah, you're good. And you go up one above. So to there. Okay. And you come out. And you come out. So I think the way we're going to do this, there's going to be a couple truck stations in here. How wide are the truck stations? They are what? 16 meters? 24 meters? We'll say 24 meters. Okay. And we don't want them too close together because we all know what happens when that happens. So... We are going to have truck stations. Uh, we are going to have our copper and our iron truck station probably in this section here. Would be my guess. Um... I think we will have our concrete maybe dumped off at that first little platform area we built. And that should be it for trucks. Right? Concrete. Because everything else is being delivered by train eventually. Yeah, that sounds right. Other than sulfur. But honestly, like one or two truckloads of sulfur will probably be fine for the game. So I will just manually hand bomb those out of the trucks if I have to. Now, this middle section. I kind of wanted our hub to be in this middle section. So this road that I'm talking about is going to come up over here somewhere. So let's kind of work that out a bit. It's going to be three. And we need at least three here. For it. 
So there's three. Yeah. And I think I would like it like this. Then another three. Okay. So we'll build a bit of a ramp down here, and then the road can kind of go off in that direction, and then down there. And then up in here is where we will have our truck stations, which take more frames and rotors than I have on me. And we're going to have two, or three to start with, excuse me. Yes. <laughs> that kind of makes sense to me. Cool. So, we can start that now, I guess. Oh, right. And then from here... So, we're going to have our truck stations here. We're going to have this also ramped down. Because the trucks will come up... Oh, actually, if we're doing one-way rows, it can just be two. It can be too wide. Okay. So in that case... There. Yeah, beautiful. Well, while we're here, let's go from here. Uh, no. Let's unlock something first, so I don't have to come back and do this later. Something from the awesome shop. How are you doing? You are making stuff, correct? Ooh, you're making stuff real fast. Distraction! <laughs> concrete. Nice. Okay, cool. Uh, awesome shot, please. <gasps> I don't have plates? Are you kidding me? <laughs> How much time do I have left? Um, okay, what I wanted to unlock was the up and down ramps. This, what? Uh, excuse me. Uh, authorized personnel only. God. Um, yeah, the sloped ramps, but the ones that are sloped on both sides. So, I am going to do that before I do any more here. So I'm going to scoot on over to our permanent temporary base and start getting that stuff. Or re refill my uh, my crafting inventory. Get rid of some of this junk. And I'll probably also rerun that coal truck while I'm there. And obviously move the stupid Caterium while I'm there as well. Because apparently that causes problems. Actually, maybe what I'll do is I will just unplug that truck station. I'll just plug it in when I need Caterium. That sounds like a better idea. Or turn it off, at least. So, yes, I'm going to go do that. So I'm going to put in a cut here, and yeah, when you, we come back, that'll all be sorted out. Oh, you stupid bean. So until that time, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please give us a like and subscribe. It helps us out a lot, and we will see you next time. Yeah. Cheers. What is happening to me? Why am I moving? Is this, like, mouse drift? Oh, it's my cable. My mouse is stuck on my keyboard. Ah, I get it. Cheers.